Okay, so um, just to show the another possibility of how you can address when you have all four corners on the last layer are incorrect, there's two possible ways that that could happen. One is where the pieces are opposite each other, and the other where they're kitty corner. In this particular case, the pieces are opposite. So the uh, yellow and blue is supposed to go over here on this side, and the yellow and green is supposed to switch here. And then similarly, red and orange should go here, or the uh, red and yellow should go here, and the orange and yellow should go right here. So this algorithm is, is relatively simple. Of all the um, alternate algorithms, this is probably one of the simpler ones. And it's going to be mostly um, middle and um, top turns. So it's going to go like this. And it's all, um, essentially, mostly, for the middle, it's going to be all double turns. So I'm going to turn the middle twice. I'm going to turn it to my left. I'm going to go two more times like this. I'm going to flip this all the way around this time. I'm going to go two more times again. Now I'm just going to give it one more flip. You'll see the blue lines up again. And two more in the middle. And everything is all done. So I'll do it again one more time. Two. Once to the left. Two. Twice. Two. Once. Two more. And now the guys are flipped back to the way that they were. You can do it in any orientation. It doesn't matter what orientation because effectively it's um, symmetric. So I'm going to go in the middle twice. I'm going to turn it once to the left. I'm going to do it twice. Turn it twice on the top. Turn it twice in the middle. Do it one more turn this way. And then flip it around and that's it. So that's an alternate algorithm when you have the two are alternate uh, across from each other. Now you can always do the three-way rotation. It's just you'd have to do it twice um, in order to be able to handle it when, it's, when you have it like this. So the purpose of this algorithm is to take care of this in, in a single algorithm. And it's pretty quick. So it's probably an algorithm worth learning. It doesn't come up that often, but when it does, you know, it shaves a couple of seconds off of your time by having an algorithm to address it.